Hello, my name is Linda Phillips. I'm the director of an educational and environmental charity called Roots and Shoots. And we've been part of the London Elm experiment and Almas London Inn. Okay, today we're going to talk about the care of the young sapling elms. Uh, that you, you will receive them we're in a pot, they would have been staked. And now you just need to prepare them ready for their autumn planting. So just a very light pruning is required and a bit of extra staking just to get them ready for this. The ideal time to prune of course is the winter time when the plant is dormant but if you do it just very lightly during the summer time that's fine as well. The reason why you should lightly prune is to enable that any lower side shoots take away the food from the main stem developing the stem and you really need to take these off and for the plant focuses its strength in developing the main stem and if in sometimes the top leader shoot has actually died out or been cut you need to reinstate that by tying in a strong shoot upward and that will ensure the tree becomes quite a stable shape if you have received an elm which is very bushy then you need to actually establish a leader and you can do this by using a stake tying it in and finding the strongest shoot then that can in fact become the leader what i'm doing here is i'm cutting off very close to the main stem cutting off this excess shoots like that and as you can see from the top of this elm here the very top leader has died out so what i'm doing is i'm looking to find a strong shoot that could be re become the new leader so i'm going to just cut this shoot out here and then i'm going to tie it up here and that becomes the new leader and it will become nice and strong by the end of the summer when you're looking to prune your elm and you're not terribly sure which shoots to actually remove always just remove the really strong vigorous ones down at the base these young ones here you can leave quite safely that's absolutely fine and then that will focus the growth on developing the strong stem and the leader from here i've removed the weak shoot and the next shoot down is much stronger so i'm going to make that into the new leader so i've attached a strong uh, twine onto the stem behind and I'm just going to tie this on and that will become the new leader by the end of the summer and I just do that not too tightly I might add it's just to guide it planting the young elm in the autumn time it's very important to prepare a good sized planting pit with plenty of room either side plant it centrally with a stake preferably um, and always make sure it's well firmed in and always water it in and then mulch with an organic mulch and the organic mulch really does help it fight any pests and disease I do hope you found my helpful hints useful and you will look after your elm for future generations and always remember to if you've got a problem uh, with rabbits or deer this young elm may need a tree guard apart from that good luck with your elm and i'm sure it will do well mm -hmm.